Hello, welcome to our mini lesson on mean, median, and mode, the middle, middle, and middle. First off, let's talk about the first one that we have there, the mean. The mean is the average. If you think about it that way, that's a great way. I mean, you're in a, a good place. Um, the mean is the average. So to find the average, what we'll do is we will add all the values together and divide by the number of values. I'll show some examples of that. If you had 20 pencils in one box and 30 pencils in the second box, what is the average number of pencils in each box? So what we're going to do is we're going to add together the number of pencils. So we take the 20 pencils from the first box, 30 pencils from the second box, we add that together. 20 and 30 is 50. The next step is that we're going to divide by, divide our total by the number of boxes. So divide 50 by, we have two boxes, 50 divided by 2 is 25. So that's going to be our final answer there. The average number of pencils per box is 25 pencils. Let's look at another question and an example. Let's say you have grades out of 20, and they're all listed below here. 15, 16, 20, 12, 18, 20, and 17. You want to know what your average grade is. You're finding the mean. All right, so what we're going to do is the same steps we did last time. First, we'll add up all of these values. So 15, 16, 20, 12, 18, 20, 17, we add them all together and we'll get 118. Now we're going to divide that by the total number of values. So we count these 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7, so there are 7 values. We'll divide the total of 118 divided by 7 for a result of about 16.86. That's about the average. Okay, that would be about your average grade out of 20 on these assignments. The third, or the second, I'm sorry, whew, stepping a bit ahead here. The second type of average that we're going to find during middle is called the median. So the mean is the average. The median is the center. Just like if you're driving down the road, this is called the median. I don't know if you've ever heard that before. This part in the road is called the median. That's the way I always think of when I think about this. We're just looking for whatever is right in the center. That's it. You list the numbers in order. You pick the number in the center. That's all the median is. So we have a list of numbers here. Let's list them first in order. So we rearrange these numbers one so that they're all from least to greatest. And now we just pick the one right in the center. Boom, five. Five is our median. All right, let's do another example of that. So we've got this list of numbers here we want to find the median, or the number right in the middle. So the first step is that we're going to list all these numbers from least to greatest. So we'll start with 13, and then we'll go to 24, 25. There's a couple of 25, so we make sure we list all of them in order. And we'll get 13, 24, 25, 25, 36, 45, 53, 62, 70. All the numbers are the same. They're just listed in order from least to greatest. And now we list through here 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. There's nine numbers. So the number right in the middle is 36. All right? So that's going to be our median. It's the number right in the middle. There is a special case with the median. Sometimes you have, in the, like in this case, six numbers or an even number of numbers. So to find the, medi the middle number, what we have to do is we have to first list them in order, just like we did, highlight the middle two numbers, and then find the mean or find the average of those two numbers. To find the average, we will add them together and divide it by two, just like we did with the mean. Right, we add them together and divide by the number of numbers. So 4 plus 5 is 9. 9 divided by 2 is 4.5, which makes sense. That's the average of 4 and 5 is 4 and a half, right in the middle. 
Okay, so that's going to give us the median or the number right in the middle. Okay, the last way of finding an approximate average is called the mode. Whatever number shows up the most. <laughs> oh man, that's funny. All right, it's whichever number shows up the most. Okay, you have a list of numbers, you choose the number that is repeated the most. I said modes so that you can, you know, try and help you remember. Let's take a list here. 25, 26, 27, 26, 24, 25, 24, 26. What we need to do is find the number that's listed the modes, the most, all right? In this case, there's 25 is listed twice, 24 is listed twice, 27 is there just once, but 26 is listed three times, so therefore 26 is the mode of this list of numbers. All right, let's use this list of numbers to try and find the mode. We have 92 in there once, twice, we have 95 just one time, 85 just one time, 93 just one time, and 100 just one time, so 92 is going to be the mode in this list, all right? It's just whichever number is in the most inside the list, all right? So here are some special cases with mode. The first special case is if all the values appear the same number of times, there is no mode. So for example, in this list, one, two, three, four, five, each number is listed just one time, there is no mode because no number appears the most. The second special case is that if there's two values and they appear the same amount of times, the most frequently, so in this case 23 appears twice and 26 appears twice, two values appearing the same number of times, they're both the most frequent number, then you would actually have two modes in this case. So you can have two modes, and we'll see an example of that in a sec. Okay, but 23 and 26 are both the solution for the mode of this list. Let's go ahead and do an example of finding all three. We're going to find the mean, the median, and the mode of this list of numbers here. First, we're going to find the mean. To find the mean, we add up all the values together, and then we take that number, 591, and we will divide by the number of numbers, or it's so one, two, three, four, five, there are six terms, or six numbers, so we divide the total, or the sum, by the number of numbers, and we'll get our mean, or the average. So the average of that list is 98.5. Let's move on to finding the median. The median is the number in the middle, right? So first off, we list the numbers in order, 92, 93, 93, 90, or 103, 105, 105. And we take the number in the middle. In this case, there are two numbers in the middle because there's an even number. So we're going to have to find the average of 93 and 103. And to do that, we'll add them together and divide by 2, and that will give us our average of 98. So you see that the mean and the median are pretty close in this case. Let's go ahead and find the mode. Remember, the mode is the number that appears the most. So both 93 and 105 appear two times, and that's the most. So we have two modes here, 93 and 105. All right, here's a quick review. The mean is the average. The median is the number in the middle. And the mode is the number that appears the most. <laughs> All right, now you know everything you need to know about mean, median, and mode. Have a wonderful day.